Let's get a check of your weather here at CBSN. Baltimore, we've got shower activity now cutting across the area. This is going to be the flavor of the day. It's a very slow moving area of low pressure. Passes west to east and dragging this light, annoying shower activity with it. It's not like rain, but you know, some, some spotty shower activity. Temperatures there would be primarily in the upper 40s, so there's going to be a chilly, damp feel to the day. But what I want you to note is big, deep area of high pressure out to the west. Combined with this low, I mean, we've got a clockwise rotation, we've got a counterclockwise rotation, and air is being grabbed from central Canada and put right over your neighborhood. And as skies clear overnight, we'll get radiational cooling, and a freeze warning will, will go into effect through 10 a.m. tomorrow. For our, uh, let's just say areas north, northwest, and west of I 95. But add to that a frost advisory in effect right along I 95, same period of time overnight through 10 a.m. The coldest weather of the year is on the way. They're going to call for a high of 53 much of the day, though, in the upper 40s. And there's that shower activity, a bit of rain at times, mostly cloudy. That 34 degrees is going to be more urban temperatures, uh, any, like a uh, Bel Air or Westminster, Baltimore City, and Annapolis. Get out into the suburbs, it's going to be more like 31 or 32 degrees. And then we keep it chilly as we move through the uh, work and school week. We don't even get back to near normal, which will be 60 until Sunday and Monday. You're watching CBSN Baltimore.